guys, how are you all? I've just jumped in an Uber and we're heading to the City Stars Mall here in Cairo. One of the biggest and best malls in Cairo. Of course, people will contradict me on that, but it is one of the biggest and best. So, um, it's in Heliopolis and we're going to go check it out. We've got our nice Uber driver here. Roads are crazy. Drivers are crazy. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Abdurrahman. Abdurrahman, nice to meet you. <laughs> you. You're not crazy, they are crazy. Sure, <laughs> sure. A little, a little. Uber is costing about uh, $2.50 and it's about 13 kilometers so you can't beat the price can you it's like national stadium there something like that or maybe it's presidential palace i have no idea all right guys we're here at the mall um i couldn't film going inside because of course there's security x-ray machine and if i had outed myself with a camera on arrival they might not let me in or they might have confiscated the camera while i came in so i'll show the outside when i leave and that way if i get kicked out it doesn't matter um but here we can see nice cafe area down the bottom there and many floors very beautiful mall ATM center hmm I need that over there so I might go and get some cash there before I leave let's spin it around and have another look it's incredible you step out of places like Giza where the pyramids are that are quite run down poor neighborhoods and then you come out here to Heliopolis and you've got this kind of mall so you know the Middle East has some of the greatest malls in the world and I wouldn't say this is one of the greatest in the world but certainly a fabulous mall and it shows the modern side of Cairo it's not all dust and uh, debris <laughs> very beautiful place and we've got all kinds of shops all the usual ones you find in all the malls all over the world you can even get a tiara here we've got candies from all over i could do with some sour candies but i shouldn't i'm trying to find a supermarket is one of my main aims for coming here as it usually is if you've seen our mall lilla mall uh video we went in the malls in Philippines to buy cat food and now we're here in Egypt doing the same because I love to help the little animals on the streets everywhere I go you know if we, even if we can make them happy for a day they deserve that they deserve much more but unfortunately I'm not in a position to uh, collect all the world's rejected animals I wish I were I'd love to set up a foundation to do just that but it's not easy to do these kinds of things so one day God will see fit to give money to the right people it looks like I found the uh, food court cafe area so I haven't found the supermarket normally in Asia the supermarkets are always in the basement floor so maybe it's down there we'll have a look we'll just do a little lap got some fantastic food options here of course Middle Eastern food and then they've got all their uh, favorite fast foods and cuisines they're quite partial to Italian here in Cairo oh it's a nice stone brick oven there the only way to do a pizza
Hello. Do you know Do you know where the supermarket is? Saudi. Yes. Right. The Lodi, this right. way. Yes. Right, and then. Your name is Saudi. Saudi. Right. 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 Okay. Thank you. Shukra. All right. So he said it's right. So it's kind of heading the right direction, but not entirely. Samsung? Oh, there it is. See all the... All right, let's hope this supermarket is big enough. I might turn this off as I go in because often that's when they bust you and then I'll turn it back on and show you some products and some prices here in Egypt. Some prices, Sensodyne what? toothbrush, uh, 45 pounds, that's about $1.50 US. Uh, Listerine, 62, it's about for a 250 mil. That's $2 US. And a tube of Sensodyne Rapid Action. That's $2.50 US for that size. And a litre of fresh milk is 29 pounds, which is one US dollar. Biscuit oil for oh, I got my uh bis chop. I love those. Nougat cookies, cocoa lovers, Milka, Cabri Galore, Snickers, Bounties, Galaxy, Yummy Healthy Chews and Crunches, more chocolates. Got a really good selection. I think I'll grab a bounty because I'm a partial to bounties and we don't have them in Vietnam also what do they have here these look quite nice don't they with almonds with almonds and cranberry almond cashew and coconut heavens Belgian chocolate with almonds I might have to go for that one I think awesome olive choices and here the cheeses fantastic cheeses 24 so just under a US dollar they've got flakes one of my all-time favorites <clears throat> but yeah I don't need too much chocolate I'm trying to be good these days lollies, tubes, more chocolates, more goodies. Let's have a look at the chip aisle. What kind of chips do they have here in Egypt? Okay, quite a few nacho chips. They've also got dips, Doritos dips. They've got a good selection of Lay's, Doritos. Doritos and Lay's seem to be the main chips they have here in Egypt. And some gourmet sea salt and balsic, balsamic vinegar. Nice. It's quite a large supermarket. Got some good products. We'll just go for a little walk through and check it out. Here's the toiletry aisle. <laughs> Baby products. Hair accessories, creams, potions. Got a great cold section too. I bet they've got some awesome cheeses. In this part of the world they have the best cheeses. Dairy. Let's come and have a look. See all their lovely cheeses. Okay, we have mayonnaises, cream spreads. Here we go, white cheeses. Fantastic white cheeses. So many, oh my god, be impossible to choose. 
yogurts, a lot of yogurt. But let me show you my favorite product in all the Middle East, just about. It's this one here. Date. Date milk. Oh my God, if this isn't the best drink ever invented, after tea that is, um, I don't know what is. That strawberry looks good too. All right, let's just quickly show you the uh, regular dry goods aisles, because I'm sure someone's gonna come and tell me to turn this off shortly. Quite a lot of products, so definitely I can recommend this supermarket. Siaudi, here at City Stars Mall. And more items up the back there. Rice's cake mix, baking, cereals, halwa, honey, delicious honeys. Look at those delicious honeys. And here we've got the bakery section. Fantastic breads here in Egypt. <laughs> here he comes. He's going to tell me to turn it off. Hello. Sorry. Okay. No problem. Okay. And let's head on over to the cat food. So I grabbed a small bag of um, sensitive because I figure most of these street cats have probably got uh, stomach problems. So that was 55, so $1.70. I'm not sure if I shouldn't have got the kitten one because often kitten has uh, more vitamins. Ugh. Actually, I might change it for the kitten one. Yeah, so we'll get the bag of kitten dry food. And we got several Felix Farina pouches. They were 31 each, so a dollar each. So I got eight of those. Let's head to the register and get out of here before I spend any more money. Godiva, Quality Streets, and here we've got our cash registers. I'll turn this off. So guys, bag full of shopping, about uh, 22, 23 US dollars, about what we normally spend in a foreign supermarket. Instead of tea though, most of it was cat food this time. All right, let's find our way out of here. So we came up, I believe. So now we need to go down. It's another security guy. Wouldn't be surprised if he tells me not to film. So I'll turn it off. So guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed this little look at a Kyrian mall. Um, this is about as beautiful as a mall can be, a very lovely mall. It was a great shopping experience, really enjoyed myself. I might see how much a uh, drink of some sort is, and then I'll be looking for a taxi to get out of here. But look at that view, isn't that fantastic? That's really nice. What a great mall. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Where? Girls on the Loose. We'll catch you in the next one. Heaps more Egypt content coming, so please keep watching. And there we go, guys. I hope you enjoyed that look inside an Egyptian mall. Fantastic, beautiful scenes in there. Lovely place to uh, while away a little bit of time, pick up some shopping. And now Habibi's taking me back to Tahrir. Hello, sir. Yes. <laughs> so he's charging me up. Careful, careful. He's charging me a uh, hundred to go back, which is 
was about three dollars and a bit so a bit more than I paid to come but that's okay let's just get going all right I'll switch this off and keep watching for more content here in Egypt